Fire, God and Fear. So this song is in standard tuning and we're going to start off with a tremolo picked riff on the power chord on the fourth fret of the A string and then we're going to play through that and then put the pinky down on five of the D so we've got four of the A, five of the D instead of six of the D. So. And then instead of the seven on the D, we're gonna play five of the bottom string and four of the A. So that chord. Place through that a few times. The last time around, you got this alternative chord, which is four of the D, four of the G. And that is the end of the first riff. So the second riff goes like this. So it's a C sharp minor chord. And then towards the end of that, we're gonna play seven of the B with the little finger. And then back down to its usual position. The other guitar plays this. So just tremolo picking six of the G to five of the B, back down to six of the G, and then up to seven of the B. At the end of that riff, we've got this. So we're just gonna play four of the A, four of the D gives you those chords. That chord, not those. Then we're back into the opening riff. Then we're back into the second riff. Then we have some power chords. And it's just five on the bottom string. Four of the A. Two of the A. Then we're gonna mute those power chords and play. So, five of the A string, no, five of the bottom string. Four of the A, down to two of the A. Five of the bottom string again. Two of the A this time. And then we've got some pick slides. I hope you're enjoying this lesson. If you are, make sure you check out my black metal guitar course. I'll put a link in the description. Then we have the solo. Now I'm not gonna talk you through each and every fret on there. I'm just gonna play it and then play it slowly and hopefully you'll pick it up. So here's the first phrase.
one more time. Underneath the solo, we've just got this. So power chord on four of the A string. And then five of the bottom string, four of the A. Then after the solo, we've got this riff again. And the part that goes with it. That we've already played. And then we're just gonna finish the song with this power chord on the fourth fret of the A. And that is the end of the song.